Hello and welcome! In this tutorial, I will show you how to make the basic settings for your device. The basic settings include the nominal values of your system, the configuration of value recordings, and the settings for the serial interfaces of your device. At the end, the configuration is transmitted to the device and saved in a file for later reuse. Depending on your device type, the configuration may be different. Expand the device tree of your project to the device you want to configure. Open the overview window of the device by double-clicking the device name. Then open the device configuration. Open the configuration of the nominal values. The nominal values are the basic performance characteristics of the system you are measuring. Set the nominal frequency. Either assign a fixed value or have the nominal frequency determined automatically. Specify whether the voltage is to be measured between phase and neutral or between phase and phase. Finally, set the nominal voltage and nominal currents of the main and auxiliary measurement. Open the recording configuration. You can use a predefined recording configuration that is based on various standards. To do so, Select the desired standard and confirm the change of the configuration. You can also add your own value recordings or adapt an existing value recording. Add the values to the record. Expand the value tree up to the value you want to record. Drag the value into the value window. On the right side, you can set how and at what time interval the value is to be recorded. Instead of an ongoing recording, a value can also be recorded only when a change occurs. Open the configuration of the serial ports. The configuration of the serial ports may vary depending on your device type. Refer to the user manual of your device for the configuration of the respective serial ports. Here, assign the device ID for Modbus and Profibus. Also, set the Modbus mode and baud rate. For the set configuration to take effect on the device, it must be transmitted. There are two options for this. First, you can use the Transmit button to change all settings directly in the device. Second, you can use the Transmit To button to change the settings in several devices at the same time. First, select which settings are to be transmitted. In the next step, define to which devices the configuration is to be transmitted. Use the Shift or Control key to select multiple devices. You can save a configuration as a file to reuse it at a later time or in another project. To do so, use the Save to File function.
use the load from file function to load the configuration into the gridvis from a file. Thank you for your interest in this tutorial. For more information, please visit wiki.janitza.de.